So we're getting started. Say hey, Cody. You know what, buddy? Say hey, man. Hey, man. All right, we're getting going. Trapping season is upon us, and we're prepping some traps. Lay them out. Pressure wash them. The most important thing, get them good and clean. And then we take some red oak dye and get Brian's heater crunk over here. <laughs> As you can see, Brian's had a little shoulder surgery. He's doing good. We don't know how to take uh, medicated Brian. <laughs> he ain't half as fun as regular Brian, which, you, you know, you just ain't. Easy now. Show them what you got. It's pretty good. You're supposed to be shooting holes in that bag? Okay, good. So anyway, we tell you, we get this water and red oak dye mixture going. It's just in a simmer. These traps here just went in. And they're gonna sit and just kind of lightly boil for a little while. I guess they were semi-flat sets. Mm -hmm. But that one big one, I'm talking like big, a pretty good bowl. Probably five, six inches deep. That's what your bait hole. You know what I'm talking about. Oh, yeah. Size of Yeah. Get on in there. Nice and easy. Don't drop it. Just <laughs> up there on the hook. Look, Cody's just holding his with his hands. There you go. Let her go. Just don't let it fall off the hook. Perfect. That's good. Pull the right bar out. You go. There you go. Let's go get another one. This is what they look like after they come out of the red dye. Those are Cody's with those steaks. Ours with those steaks. You want to make sure you have them rusted really good before you put them in the dye or they will not take the dye. We're going to let them cool down, then we're going to put them in wax here in just a minute. All right. Now we'll get some water in a bucket and water in another bucket in a bucket. What? And we're going to set this wax in there. And so once it in, starts Amy. boiling, let this wax boil in here. Right, and then we're going to dip traps. Settle this bad boy in there. Let it heat up for about 15 seconds. Don't want to get your wax too hot or it can cause problems. And then you just pull it out real slow. traps are done you can kind of see they're coated in wax I'll do a video sometime I'll tell you about all the parts of these traps and kind of the various types of stakes and springs but there they are 